so let's go back to my last video which was um when i went on vacation to dominican republic so this is where things got a little spicy and this is where things happened so basically we was on vacation um you know living our best life you know just living our best life so <clears throat> um we came back you know things was happening whatever um then let's fast forward to february so february i was supposed to get my period and i kept getting like cramps here and there um i was realizing when i was laying on my stomach like my boobs were hurting and like my stomach just felt kind of weird like it felt off but i was getting cramps so i'm like okay i'm gonna get my period soon and i really worrying about it or whatever so fast forward it comes the day i'm supposed to get my period i wake up i don't have my period i don't get my period throughout the day i'm like all right it's normal sometimes it's like a day late um whatever so um a couple of like two days go by so i'm um, three days late already um i go out to eat with my mom for one of her friend's birthday party or well, her birthday whatever so we go to eat and we sit in there we eating right normal i'm eating everything i'm holding down the food i'm not getting nauseous i don't feel weird but i was getting like some cramping here and there still because i'm getting the cramping i'm like oh okay like you know my period should be coming soon like you know not really worrying about it but i'm three days late already so on our way there i told my mom i'm like mom i haven't gotten my period i'm three days late she just looks at me and she's like um were you using protection and i was like i know and then she was like well and don't you think you should take a test and i was like yeah i'm like if i don't get it by tomorrow in the morning i'll go by a test and i'll take it and see whatever so we all right so we're eating you know like normal nothing so i come home i go to sleep again my boobs is feeling weird my stomach is hurting i'm like nah there's something going on like something's not right so i'm like okay cool the next morning it's the morning time i call my boyfriend i'm like babe i'm four days late on my period um i don't know and then mind you when i was like a day late i told him i'm like oh my period is a day late he was like oh yeah that's fine because normally like my period would be like a day late so that really wasn't like um a sign but then once i was four days late already he was like all right so go go get a test and take it and see what it says so i'm like all right so mind you this is where it get juicy so i take myself to the pharmacy and i buy a test i went by myself but my mom and my boyfriend knew that i was already gonna take one so my mom is like she's very supportive and she's not like you know i have a lot of support in my house thank god so like i wasn't really worried if it was positive or not because i know regardless like my family has my back and so does my boyfriend so i really knew like okay if i am like i am you know i know what i was doing so <laughs> i can't be surprised you know all right so i come back home and i take the test and I have a video, so I'm gonna put that video now. He's late. And it's weird because I've been having cramps and like I feel normal. Like I don't feel different, but you know. And my period is four days late. I'm actually very scared. But excited. But scared. So the test is right here. I have it face down. I haven't looked at it yet. And so, kind of want to look at it now, but I'm kind of nervous, so let's look at it. Okay. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> so, I go, you know, I pee on a stick, obviously, and I put it um face down right i'm just standing there i'm like oh my god oh my god should i turn it over oh my god but mind you i didn't facetime my boyfriend because i wanted to record it in case i was pregnant 
I know I wanted to do a YouTube video on that. So I have the, you know, the clip of me reacting to it. So as soon as I flipped the test over, you guys will see in the video, there was two lines. I was shocked. I didn't think I could get pregnant. Like nobody thinks they could get pregnant until they really get pregnant. So it's like, ooh, you'd be like, oh shit, I could get pregnant, whatever. But mind you, I was like, oh fuck. Like I'm dead ass pregnant. Like what the fuck? I could really get one person. Like damn, I could really have a child. Like, okay. So the first thing that I did was I called my boyfriend. I FaceTimed him because we weren't together. Like, we was boyfriend and girlfriend, but we wasn't in the same house at the time. Like, he was somewhere else and I was he in my house. So I called him, I FaceTimed him, and I'm like, babe. He was like, you are? I was like, yeah. He was like, dead ass? And I'm like, yeah. And I showed him. He was like, oh, shit. And then he was with his, um, one of his, like, closest best friends. And he was like, yo, Samantha's pregnant. And he was like, what? He was like, baby, 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 I'm gonna call you right back. I'm gonna call you right back. And he hung up. And I was bawling. I was crying. I wasn't crying because I was scared or I was sad or, you know, I was crying because I was like, oh my God, like I'm about to have a child in nine months. Like, so then I called my mom and I told my mom, I said, mom, she said, what? She was like, you are? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> she was like, I know he was going to do that to me. I know he was going to do that. She was like, I know it. I know it. I know it. And she said, like, oh my God. And then she put, she was like, when was your last period? And I told her the day of my last period. She was like, oh, that means you're going to be due October 7th. Like she was, she was excited. She was very, very much excited. Um, But no, that's not her first grandchild. It was her third grandchild. Um, So she was so excited but she was just like oh my god now i'm gonna have to worry that because you're pregnant and you're working and you know outside is very much ghetto so you know she was just scared because of that but um i do have a lot of support in my household so i wasn't really like oh my god i'm about to raise this child on my own because my boyfriend is such an amazing dad my family is so supportive like my dad's side my mom's side even my boyfriend's family side like they're very much supportive so you know i don't lack support thank god um but fast forward a few months october 8th my son was born yes i did have a boy um and i'm gonna like include some pictures in here maybe i'll do like the time lapse now it's like a a slideshow of like each week that i was pregnant that i have until the day he was born um so you guys can see that as well but i really didn't have like a a crazy like finding out i was pregnant story i mean i feel like it was pretty regular so yeah um but that's pretty much the story thank you guys so much for watching my youtube video please make sure to like comment and subscribe and also leave any video suggestions that you have in the comments down below so that i can make those videos for you guys and also don't forget to follow my instagram at underscore keeping up with sam underscore and thank you guys so much for watching Bye.